Okay, this is what I got right there on Amazon. Pretty cheap, they're like $12. It might have been a little bit more than that, but they're pretty cheap. Break this apart, let's get it ready to go. So, it's gonna go, God, it's hard to hold on to. So it's gonna go like that. Pretty neat. Ugh. Come on now, work with me. Work with me. So just like that. So what I'm using for bait is I had an old roast that's going bad. Chicken would work. Pretty much anything you throw in here is gonna work. But I'm gonna try just a big old slab of meat, see if that works or not. Might get him going. Attach to it. Now this thing's kind of tricky. Get it like that. Just kind of just kind of pinch it apart and then just hook it like that. Okay, let's go toss this in right there. Should work. get that other one rigged up and go put it somewhere else and see if we can find them I'm not sure they're there the water's so murky it's hard to see but they were here last year so they got to be here again so let's see what happens all right we're just gonna drop this right here the water seems to be swirling give that a try right there see what happens here Die. So now we play the waiting game. So we're gonna we're gonna go back into town for a little bit, get some dinner and some lunch, and come back out here and see if we got anything. Hopefully we got a whole bunch of them. Cause I am ready for a crawdad boil. Okay, guys. So heading back, I uh, ended up not catching nothing. I went back there last night, didn't catch anything. So I swapped out the roast, the roast beef. I, I just they're not eating it. So don't ever use roast beef as your bait, cause they do not like it. So I went to the store, grabbed some chicken legs, put some chicken legs in there, and I th think that's going to do the trick. That's usually what I catch them on normally is chicken. So that's what we're going to do now. So we're going to head there and see if we can catch some because I am hungry and I want to eat some crawdads or crawfish or crayfish or whatever everybody calls it. But we're heading out, so we'll see when we get out there, guys. Hopefully we got some in the traps because this is my first time ever using traps. Usually I just catch them with my hands, so this is going to be kind of fun. So peace guys, we'll see you guys soon. Alright boys, let's see what we caught today. Let's, let's have a meal please, let's have a meal. You always want to target these rocky places, you want to catch crawdads around the rocks is a great place to set a trap all right let's see here hey guys look at that we got quite a few in there cool some big ones too i'm happy with that beggars can't be choosers right haha <laughs> sweet awesome boys that is cool. Let's go check our other one real fast. See if we got a couple in there. We might be able to make a meal out of that. I think so. Beggars can't be choosers. All right. Whoa. 
Jeez, guys, those are roly poly rocks right there. Almost landed on my butt. What do we got in here? Yeah, just one guy. All that chicken do himself. Jeez, bud. You've been really chowing down, too. <laughs> wow. Cool. Got us some crawfish to take home and eat. I can't wait. Got us some crawfish. Can't wait to take it home and eat it. Bad for a cheap Amazon crawfish trap. That's pretty cool. Can't beat that. Well, let's get these boys out of there and check them out, shall we? That is a big boy right there. Woohoo! That's a big old guy. That's a big old dude. I don't know if I want him to pinch me or not. That might hurt. Ow. Woo. Ha <laughs> ha. Too slow, bro. Too slow. It's a little cold, so they're a little slow right now. Yeah, that's cool, man. Kill. Cool. Well, let's take these bad boys home and eat them, shall we? Let's take these bad boys home and chow down. All right, guys, we are back. Now, I'm just, I just put him in a cooler. Just cleaning them out. I don't have to do it that long because there's not very many of them, but it's a good idea to do that. It just cleans the crawfish out of that. They're out of that dirty, nasty water, so it's just best just to clean them off a little bit, but that's what we're doing right now. Just garden hose. Oh! Yeah, don't let that happen. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much what we were doing, guys, so. Let's go inside and let's get our meal prepped because it's going to be good. Crawfish boil coming at you. <laughs> All right, so what we got is some hot sausage. We got some onions, potatoes, mushrooms, garlic, and lemons. I am missing, I am missing, uh, I am missing corn on the cob. Really hard to get. So I didn't get to, I didn't get to get any. So that's gonna only be downfall of this. But other than that, it should be pretty good. Also using Louisiana style crawfish boil, good stuff right here. So yeah, should be pretty delicious, pretty juicy, I'd say. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's get to cooking, guys. Okay. All right, in goes our boil flavor mixture. That should be perfect right there. We're not cooking a whole bunch, so I don't need to use the whole bag, I don't think, anyway. Now we're just gonna stir the pot. Let that finish to a boil. And then we're gonna add our sausage. So that's the first thing that's gonna go in is sausage. In goes our sausage. We're just gonna do our potatoes. Try not to get splashed, that burns. <clears throat> now we're gonna let that cook for a few minutes and then we're just gonna kinda keep adding things. The softer the stuff, I'm gonna use those for the end. And then the last thing that's gonna go in is our crawfish. And we're gonna cook that for five minutes. All right, next is just our onion. Put that in there. Beautiful. And then in goes our garlic. Our mushrooms. And then some lemon juice. Or lemons, I should say. Oh yeah. It's gonna be looking good, guys. Looking good. All right, guys, here's our crawdads. Let's get them in there. So they're going to be good. Ooh, can't wait, man. Okay, they're all in there. Pretty good, man. 
It's gonna be good, guys. Absolutely delicious. Cannot wait for that sucker to start cooking right, and we'll be ready in about five, six minutes, and it's gonna be bomb. All right, guys, we are all done. Look at that, it is beautiful. Mmm. Can't wait to start digging in on this, man. That is just a nice, pretty little meal right there. I mean, those are, got some pretty good, I mean, those are some pretty big ones right there for around here. So anyway, let's just try some stuff right here. Got the mushroom. I'm not even, a, I'm not even a big fan of mushroom, but that's freaking good. And then we got some sausage. This is hot sausage. I got the hottest I could get, so. Mmm. Mmm-hmm. <laughs> that's good. Wow. Woo! Hot. That is hot. And of course, we always got our little baby potatoes. Mmm. <laughs> that's good. Wow. Hot, though. Woo! Make sure you let it cool off a little longer. <laughs> So since I'm self-filming, I'm gonna dig into one of these right here, and I'm gonna get it all ready to go and eat that, but I can't, I gotta have two hands because I suck at it, so just one minute, guys. Okay, so find that middle tail, break it. Pull, get that poop point, that mud vein out, or blood vein, or whatever the heck you guys call her. Break, twist, slurp. Mm. That's good stuff. And now just break into this. Peel this baby off of there. I'm not real good at it, guys. I'm not real good at it. Ha <laughs> ha, nice little meat right there. Mm. That's the good stuff, guys. That is good, wow. Can't wait to eat all this, man. Just a nice little meal, just for myself, you know? Nothing, you know, nothing too fancy. Just feeding myself, it's all I really need right now. So anyway, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my dinner. These mushrooms, oh my God, look, they're good. I don't even like mushrooms either, and that's good. That's really good. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I'm gonna finish my food. Hope you enjoyed this video of this crawfish boil catch and cook with a $7 uh, Amazon trap. I'll link in the description if you wanna buy one and try it out. I mean, there's nothing really to it, but anyway, it turned out to be a good time. I loved it. I'm gonna catch more of these. If you wanna see more, comment below, please. If you wanna see more crawfish boils, I need some ideas, so give them to me. Comment, guys. Love y'all. Peace.